To be a professional is it's quite a difficult thing really. When you win, you are fantastic, you're this amazing you know, player. When when you lose, unfortunately, you're quite the opposite. There's never a middle ground. You know, with regards to mental health, in the South African uh, context, it's still, it is, there's a stigma attached to it and it is frowned upon. If you do have a mental health issue that you perhaps are less of a person than the one that doesn't. So it's, I think it's more frowned upon. I had an operation just before a World Cup in 2003 uh, to my the carpal tunnel syndrome and uh, ulnar nerve that it dislodged. So I did lapse into uh, depressive states and I didn't quite understand it to be honest with you. Literally the, the feeling, you can't explain the feeling of helplessness. You, you're sort of sitting there and, and trying to, to mentally you know, build yourself up into something and to, to back to where you were. Um, and unfortunately, you know, all the things that you used to do or try to do to get yourself to that state where you, you're fairly content with things uh, was very difficult and I, because I considered myself to be mentally strong and because I'm a professional rugby player, why shouldn't I be? Um, yeah, I, I, that for me was the greatest difficulty is not being able to dig myself out of that hole without the use of the medication which you know, thankfully you know, through the psychiatrist managed to get me onto something that got me to an equilibrium where I could start functioning as a normal person again. I, th I do think it's vitally for me, for people like myself to speak out about it because you don't want to get to that point where you know, that one person unfortunately takes his life because he perhaps was too embarrassed to speak out about it, was too embarrassed to reach out, uh, be it to a parent, be it to a peer, be it to a professional. But I think you know, times are changing. As long as we can help other people to understand what it's all about and that it is something that's curable and it's also something that you can live with on a daily basis. Imagine a guy that's depressed now and I'm pretty sure there are sportsmen in our country out there that are battling with some sort of depression. Imagine how well they could perform if we are assisting that process and embracing it as opposed to you know, attaching a stigma to the individual.